one day in the books of seven on seven season, but it was a real good one for you guys. Absolutely. What went so well for y'all to to start with that kind of a tone set? Both sides of the ball for, I mean, for this tournament and for this entire spring. First off, we were just hungry to play. We've been waiting all season long to get back started. And we got a new team, so it was really just like the chemistry building and getting to know each other. So we had to come out with an energy and set the tone defensively and offense. Uh, the second game, offense, um, they didn't come out with a lot of energy, but defense had to pick the team back up. And then offense finished the game up for us to get that win. And that's how we really like set the tone for the today, day two. What is the, the process for a team where a lot of you guys know each other somewhat, especially like different regions, the, the North guys know each other well, the South guys know each other well, but for it to be y'all's first day as a full team and have those ebbs and flows where, okay, the, deep, the offense makes a couple mistakes, the defense can pick them up, the offense can step up from this moment, you know, maybe when you guys have a, a bust or whatever and the other team does score, to be able to play some complimentary football and be on the same page, how does that happen? Kind of take me behind the scenes of, of what, what went into it. It's really just both sides of the ball, picking each other back up after we mess up. Um, getting to know each other is also important because when somebody mess up and you yelling at the next person, that's not really going to help the team. We didn't do that yesterday. Both sides of the ball was helping each other out when we made mistakes. So I feel like that that was a big part in our victories yesterday and why we won a lot of games. You had a nice uh, end zone interception. I think, I think yours was like a leaping, maybe a little bit tip. Tip ball. ball. You, you came across as you pulled down. Talk me yes. through that play and how exciting it was to be able to add that sort of a highlight to what y'all were doing. Uh, well, Mason Moore broke the pass up in the end zone at uh, safety. And I saw the ball. I, I, I turned around. I saw the ball in the air. So, you know, I had to go get it to get the extra points for the team. And that was just an exciting moment because we in front of, like, a big crowd of people. And we, we going out here for a big uh, trophy to come win this all. So. What does it mean to be a part of a big bootleggers national team with guys from all over the state to, to go to a tournament this big? You're a guy that is, like, you know kind of the deal and some of the significance. And we talked a little bit about your excitement to be a part of it. How would you kind of explain to people the significance for you? Uh, it's very um, important to me because a lot of the hard work that we put in to get here, it didn't come easy. They don't just put anybody on this team. We all on the team for a reason. So when we got selected to play, we already know what the deal was to come out here and represent for the boot. 